Well, hello, Libras and Geminis. We're here to do your love reading. Okay, today is going to be for October the 3rd until maybe November the 2nd, around that time. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to take two oracle cards and then we're going to take um, a tarot card from Hit Chick. Okay, all right. So don't forget now to like our videos and share them. And please don't forget to join us here. Hit that button over there to the right. There's a logo just like that. Send the moon goddess. Okay. All right, Libra and Gemini's. Okay. You might wonder how I got to Libra and Gemini's is because you guys are soulmates. All right. Thank you, Spirit. All right, so we have our oracle cards for that deck. Now we're going to take these, Spirit, for Libra. Thank you. All right, that was quick, but Gemini is used to that, Libra. <laughs> All right, Twin Flame. Forgiveness. You're the best th that I ever, you're the best ever happened to me. I've been waiting. No, I've been watching your social media. So if you guys just met, mm, I'm sorry for giving you false hope. Hopes. I'm cutting you off now. Wow. Okay. So those are our, our, our oracle cards. We're going to do a seven card tarot card spread that I kind of made up myself, but I haven't named it. Okay, Spirit, thank you. Two, three, four, five, six. And now we need that advice card. Those Libras and Gemini. Now our first card is going to be the energy of your relationship right now. Mm. You guys know you belong together, so you're moving forward. You, you, you already know you belong together, okay? Now, <clears throat> how are you feeling about each other? Mm. You know you guys have a strong foundation, so um, you guys feel strong about your relationship right now, okay? Now the foundation. You're still creating a foundation, but I'm hearing it is a, a strong one. I mean, it said it right here. All right. Your connection is very strong, very passionate. Okay. Where you guys are headed. You guys are almost feeling like it's... Uh, uh, the connection is so strong and you love each other so much. It, it's almost like it's a toxic love. You kind of feel like it's a toxic love, um, but it's not. But that's how you, the feeling you get me, you're getting right here. That's your near future. And now, um, I'm sorry, that's where you had it. And um, you guys are still creating your, your is like a, a endless, creating of the relationship and the connection you guys are always creating okay you both are air signs so you get each other all right your advice you need to come up with a plan for your goals all right um, I'm hearing some of you might even be getting um, engaged or married so <clears throat> you kind of like coming up with a plan so you, you need your plan, all right? 
So we're going to add on to your energy. Um, it need to be a little more uh, communication. And I'm hearing this Gemini, you need to, a little more co communication. And then you guys, uh, um, you, you're growing, but you need to start manifesting more. Okay. And realize that you guys are, are, are being guided together. All right. All right. <clears throat> now, the foundation, the foundation spirit, the foundation. Thank you. The foundation. What does three create? Mm, okay. All right. Uh, <clears throat> I see one of you guys had like a, a habit of buying. And um, you, you finally kicked the habit. Or you guys made plans to kick the habit. I see savings coming your way. I see... Um, uh, uh, you having more money, but it's, it's like first they sing to the, 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 it's the spinning so you can pay off bills and won't be in debt again. Won't go that route again. And um, if you guys are not engaged, I, I do see engagement. But I do hear your, your communication's got to be a little bit stronger. Yeah. Remember, you guys are being guided. And you're being guided. Some of you um, thinking about babies, um, adding on to the family. Spirit saying, it's time. It's time to, to move up. Okay, um, keep praying and meditating, okay? I'm hearing the, the, some of your goals that, you, that you're trying, trying to achieve. More love in the relationship, more communication in the relationship. Um, even, um, sorry, Spirit. All right, even um, goals. Keep creating, keep making more goals, more goals, okay? That connection is already tight where you had it. A lot of passion. And, bo and both of you guys are saying, let's do it. <laughs> I'm here, okay? Don't wait, don't listen to others because I see interference. I, is interference coming your way, all right? If you stick to your love and, and knowing each other, and keep moving it forward, you're going to get victory. Okay? And keep this relationship going. And, and, and mm -hmm. keep them plans are coming. Do not listen to others this month. They don't have your best interests. Okay? Look, they saying for you guys to go forward with your plan. You will have success. All right. See, uh, you guys are <clears throat> you guys are thinking toxic. I even see that one of y'all might maybe even thinking the other one has someone else. Um, that's not the case, but they want you guys to take your time. Okay, keep manifesting. All right, keep working on yourself and your goals. There will be a change in your relationship, but I see marriage. I do see more money, but I also see um, um, you got to break that habit. And I do see growth in the family. Yes, growth in the family. Yes. So if you've been thinking about um, children, this is a good time, they sing. All right. They don't want you to listen to others and, and going with that. You need to communicate with each other. That's, that's what's going to make you guys happy. All right. So if someone said something to you, um, I'm here in Gemini, are you thinking 
one way or another, Gemini, or some, something that is not going to happen or it hasn't happened yet. Okay? You need to speak up so the communication could be, go through. All right. I'm, <laughs> this is the near future, and this is the card. I'm telling you, one of you guys... If you don't want babies, you better do something about it because I'm hearing there, there's going to be a lot of passion, passion this month. And, and if, if it's a baby you want, that's going to happen. Okay. All right, spirit. This is the near future. So this could be, um, November or, um, the end of October. All right. Again, don't listen to what others have to say. Keep meditate. Keep meditating, praying on your goals. Um, keep your date nights. Don't don't cancel them. Have patience with one another. And um, I do see a baby. I also see a little travel for you guys. But I, whatever you're going for as a couple this month, I do see success. But I, I do see travel for you, for you, Libra and Gemini. Okay. All right. Let's get to these oracle cards. Now, Spirit just threw these out already. It says, I've been watching your social media. So, it might be some explaining you're going to have to do. But one thing for sure, this is found. This is the person for you. This person wants to um, help you out. They, wanna, they want you. They, they want you. They want to build a family with you. They want to build a family with you. But it is like you worry. Maybe you've been with this person before. You've been. <clears throat> I'm here in Libra. You, you might have been with. With. Um, okay. With Gemini before. And you scared the same thing is going to happen. Because you was watching a social media. And you see. Yeah. You're going to have to let that fear go. All right. And you guys are going to have to come to a neutral agreement about your social media. Yeah. All right. Maybe you maybe you need to take social media away. OK, I'm sorry for giving you false hopes. Yeah. Mm. Spirit is saying. Libra, you've been giving Gemini false hope, or you, you're thinking way too much on this. Yeah. You're, they saying your standards is way too high, okay? And, and, and um, you need to rethink this, yeah. Because this person, this person is good for you. They're very nurturing. They want to provide for you. They love you. And they want to get married. This is a go. All right. So it's not false hopes. Okay, I'm hearing Libra that didn't think marriage was good, but now Libra is having a different thought because now they feel like they can provide for you. They think they can make you happy now. Okay. Yes. So you can provide for them. All right. <laughs> You're the best thing that ever happened to me. Okay, Libra. Is that what you're going to come up with? <laughs> yes. Yes. This is... Once you say this, Libra, you're going you're gonna to win Gemini over. 
And it, this person is going to come out with a lot of passion. See, only thing you guys need to do is have some good communication, not listen to others when it, when it comes to your family. All right. And you need to talk over if, if, if babies is not on the agenda right now. You need to talk it over, but I hear it is, and that's what's going to make you guys both happy. All right. Okay. We clarify. I'm cutting you off now. Now, this is not for all of you, but it might be for some of you, but they still love you. Gemini is running. They have a lot of love for you. They, 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 Gemini is afraid they're going to get hurt. But you got you to gotta let them know how you are devoted to the relationship, Libra. Yeah. How you want this to work. How this person turns you on. How you willing to work hard. Make only you only want to see them happy. So if if walking away makes them happy, then you leave her. I hear you saying that's that's okay. Although it would make you unhappy. Okay? So stop Gemini. Forgiveness. Stop focus. Focusing your energy on past events. For life is too precious to waste. You create your reality about, about what you think, dream, and imagine. Okay? So, <clears throat> you need to forgive that person. You might even need to forgive give Libra for the past. Okay? And if you look at the past, it's not as bad as you thought it was. Yeah. The fights that you had, okay? Because that was a lack of communication. Okay, you guys are going to be good together, but you, you got to start foc focusing on the relationship and then watch it grow, okay? Leave other people out of your relationship. Have good communication. Have some patience with one another. Date nights, look, date nights. Okay? And then there you'll watch your, your love life grow. All right, and 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 the that Libra who who's saying to I'm gonna cut you off. You've just been overthinking everything they want you to know. See, you've been overthinking things. Because you really do love them, and you do you do want a second chance. Because you know you can have a good life with, with Gemini and vice versa. Because what? Your twin flame. <laughs> All right, Libras and Geminis, just have good communications, a little patient with one another this month. All right? And then you're going to see the flames flying between you. All right? All right, Libra and Gemini, I love you. Thank you for spending your time with me. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I am Sin, the moon goddess.